Okay, now, if I could just find where... Oh! Oh, hello! <laughs> you must be... Uh, here for the tour, yes, of course. Just you? Oh, I guess new recruits are just few and far between these days. That's fine, that's fine. I'll be happy to show you around. That's my job, after all. See the name tag? And the hat. <laughs> so, shall we? And ta-da! It's the main hall. Yes, the main hall. Visible from the main entrance. Amazing, isn't it? Its massive dome ceiling reaches several stories up just to accommodate the leader of the hero's massive ego. <laughs> what? I said to accommodate the leader of the hero's massive statue. I mean, look at this thing. I believe it's made of bronze, probably hollow on the inside, but it must have cost a pretty penny. Personally, I'd be rather embarrassed to have a gigantic statue of myself like this. I mean, it's a bit much, isn't it? Anyway... And now, just beyond this door, are the illustrious bathrooms. Well, usually we have a, a few more heroes on the tour, and someone always asks, Do you need to use them at all? No? All right then, on with the show. These hallways are always so much longer than I remember. <laughs> so, new hero, what is your power, if I may ask so boldly? Really? How unique. <laughs> With that kind of power, you could have easily used it more selfishly. How commendable of you to join the hero profession. My power? Well, I have the power to show you this. It's the, uh, the locker room. Yes, the locker rooms. This is where you change into your hero costume, presumably. Then you come back from getting your ass handed to you by the villains and wash off the shame. Or the blood of their henchmen. Anyway, it doesn't look like anyone is in here to meet, so let us continue. I'm afraid I'm just your average... Powerless tour guide. One of the cogs in the machine, if you will. No one to really remember. Speaking of, this door looks auspicious. It must be... The janitor's closet. Of course. Well, you never know when you'll need a paper towel or something. Come along. Come along. I'm sure there's much more interesting things to show you a few floors up. Just step inside this elevator. Step lively. Any questions so far? Oh, uh, do you mind scanning your little badge there? The hero's headquarters has very strict security. We can't be too careful here. You do have your hero badge, right? Ah, very good, very good. I was starting to wonder if maybe you were some kind of undercover villain sneaking in here. <laughs> Could you imagine? <laughs> ah. 
I did press the right floor button, didn't I? I did. Here we are. The view is absolutely spectacular, isn't it? You can see the entire city from here, and we're not even at the top floor. This looks to be one of the hero's rooms. I mean, <laughs> I mean, of course it is. Only the top brass rests here, of course. Will you be staying in the building? I know you're new, but with your gifts... Oh, no? Well, I'm sure you'll prove yourself in no time, little hero. We could take a look into one of the other rooms. I'm sure no one will mind. Just to see what it's like before you get one yourself. From the gaudy, pretentious, golden plaque on the door, this is the heroic leader's room. It's a lot messier than I thought it'd be. Hey, I have that same lamp. Small world, hmm? Oh, right. So, here it looks like they have their own insanely huge bedroom to throw dirty laundry all over. And an adjoining bathroom, which we will not be looking further into. A living space, but no kitchen. Did we miss a cafeteria on another floor? Oh well. Hmm. Oh, I was looking for... I suppose it wouldn't be here. Oh, yes, here it is. Of course, they would just leave it on the nightstand. I just thought of the best room on this floor that you simply must see. Come, young hero. It's the security room. There will certainly be people to meet there. I do have my own badge for this door. Just one moment. Hello, everyone! <laughs> and good night, everyone. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, little hero. Come in. Here. You can use one of my masks until the air clears. I'm immune myself. I just get a little bit of a headache. But time is of the essence. I just want to show you this. See here? This is all the footage of you and I. Here you are, meeting me at the entrance. Then, there we are, taking our little tour. <laughs> the bathrooms, the locker rooms, the closet. <laughs> then, of course, the bedroom of the symbol of justice. Or rather, the symbol of... Never doing your own laundry. <laughs> and here is you, using your badge in the elevator for me. That's pretty important right there. <laughs> what am I planning? Well, I already enacted my plan. It's over. I just thought I'd give you a choice here, because this looks uh, pretty bad for you. I planned on erasing this all and just making a clean getaway. But if you don't let me, then they just might think that you were a mole sent by me this whole time. They might even put you in that scary little prison that they have for rogue superhumans. 
I've broken out of there a few times, and and trust me, it is very scary. <laughs> For instance, the menu items are hardly diverse enough, and the daily tests and torture are pretty painful. I'm mostly upset about the menu, though. So, what will it be? Will you let me erase these tapes, or will we fight? You will lose, by the way, as I lied about the whole powerless cog in the machine thing. In case you haven't figured that out yet. <laughs> Tick tock. These useless security drags won't sleep forever, and I can't stand around for hours. Ah, <laughs> <gasps> you will let me do it. My hero. Just a moment. I have the perfect device to clean up this footage, and to save it for my own viewing pleasure later. Now, now, I'm not currently blackmailing you with anything. I just want something to remember you by. I wasn't kidding about your powers. They sound intriguing. My door is always open for you if you should decide to switch sides. You would look very good in a more villainous cut. <laughs> well then, I believe I must collect my things and leave you. We'll meet again, little hero. Count on it. Oh, and don't worry about the guards. I'm sure this isn't the first time that they've fallen asleep on the job. I mean, who would be insane enough to break into the very headquarters with all of the strongest heroes in our city? <laughs> Even if they happen to be busy with some other very distracting disaster far, far away. <laughs> Farewell, then, little hero.